Well, Johnny, congratulations. What a game qualification as well secured in the Europa League. What's the mood in the camp like after that one? I think, um, obviously, delighted that we're three. Um, obviously, scoring in the last minute, it's always nice too to sort of come back and, and, and guarantee that qualification. Um, probably disappointed in, in certain aspects of the game, but you know, I think we can be pleased with our spirit and the way we came back and you know, numerous times in the game. And uh, you say showed, showed you know great character from the lads. Were you aware in those latter moments that a goal would probably seal qualification? Someone from the bench let you know. No, I think before the game, you know that. I think, yeah. um, you know, in a, in a 14 group, I think, you know, I think you get into 10 points, you sort of think, and it's not many teams go out of the group on 10 points. And um, we knew we'd put ourselves in a good position. Um, you know, so coming away here, very difficult game against a good team. Um, and, you know, like I say, to get that point was, 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 was great in the end. And what do you think it says about this team that they kept going until the very end to get such a positive result? Yeah, I mean, um, it was a great, great uh, goal to be fair. We pulled back, you know, we got in the game, and you're sort of thinking, you know, we've got our point. Obviously, you know, then they, they break away and score, and you're just thinking, uh, I think it was about four, maybe four minutes left or so. I still think we felt we would get, would get a chance in the game, you know, especially the last 20 minutes. We were really putting them under pressure and, and looking dangerous. And after the Liverpool game, we've seen this season just how good Leicester City can be at hitting back from setbacks, disappointments, and we've seen it here again tonight. Yeah, I mean, I think, you know, the manager always talks about not getting carried away, you know, when we win. And, and it's the same when, when you lose, you know, you've got to analyse the game and, and be calm and, um, you know, carry out our game plan. And I think the good thing that we've been able to do, um, you know, especially this season, you know, we lost a couple of the games, obviously the West Ham game in Aston Villa, and we came back from that and, you know, picked up some good results. And how important is it that four games into this campaign with two to go in the Europa League, Qualification sealed, so you can now look at what else is going on in the Premier League as well. Yeah, but you know we want to win the group. Um, I think it, uh, it would allow you, you know, um, a better path when we get in the next round into the qualifications um, and the knockout stages. And you know, there's also a bit of pride there. We want, to, you know, you could see tonight Braga. I think that puts them obviously still in a position where. They still might be able to win it themselves, so we've got to make sure that um, you know we, we remain determined to do that and um, you know come away as champions of our group. And the fixture schedule it keeps on going. Fulham at home next in the Premier League. How are you feeling ahead of that one next week? Nice that it's on Monday. <laughs> Gives you know an extra couple of a couple of hours to recover and um, but, you know Here's we've got the squad. Johnny. We've got the squad to do it. Um, we just need to make sure that we recover well and. Um, I think all the boys are enjoying, you know, the game's coming all the time and the lads are getting plenty of minutes. Um, it's a challenge physically, but, you know, it's one that we've, I think we're up to.